as we'll be starting now. Okay, so yeah, it's week three, uh, SGS, month one. Uh, I'm happy you guys are all here and, you know, more or less trying to be active. Uh, we don't have so many people on the call today. Maybe if you can just uh, go to the Slack channel and maybe remind people to join. Uh, in the meantime, we will start doing our real table check. So yeah, this is good. This is great. So announcements from the team we have is we will be having um, tutorials today. Uh, we will also be uh, scheduling calls. Uh, for one-on-one -on -one calls with our for uh, Wednesday. So we will be finalizing to, uh, that today as well. Um, what else do we have? Um, yeah, I think that's all. Uh, maybe, uh, maybe someone from the team can jump in and let us know if there's any announcements. Maybe Abdullah need any announcements from your site. Um, no, no announcements. Okay, okay, great. Yeah, that's good. So we will be doing more applications this week. Uh, apart from, we will be doing both uh, jobs we that are recommended to us on the Leap system and also from other sites as well. But we will still be using uh, tenants to record all the jobs we are applying for. So you need to record uh, all the jobs on tenants so that we can, so that we'll be able to see and just track all the jobs. And also, it will be uh, useful for you to um, to track all the stage stuff, like the application process on tenants as well. So yeah. That's all. I think that's all we have on our slide. So we can start our usual roundtable stand up. So we need volunteers. Um, the questions we have for today is How are you feeling? What did you do during the weekend? Um, are you uh, ready to fully start applying to jobs? And uh, even though our like minimum targets per day is kind of maybe 10 jobs could be 10 or more. So what's what what like what's your targets um, for job applications? Um, what else do we have? And also uh, is your application material ready, like 100 percent ready? If not, uh, please tell us uh, on which parts we can like provide support. Uh, we should be able to finalize our all uh, application materials by uh, last week, but uh, yeah, we can still review today. And what else do we have? Yeah, and also how are you looking at the sessions that are being um, provided on the job search uh, week? Yeah, I think that's all the question we have. Uh, maybe I can first any volunteers before I type in everyone's name. Anyone who would like to go first? Anyone? Okay, okay, great. As always, Abu Bakr, Abdul Rahman, um, yeah, we need more hands. Okay, maybe Abu Bakr, you can go first and then Abdul Rahman, and then we can continue. Good morning, everyone. Uh, can you hear me? Yes, yes, we can. Good morning. OK. Uh, so yeah, uh, last week, I actually tried uh, some things, but I didn't have much time because there was issues or like uh, there was someone sick. We had to take care of them. So. So yeah, I didn't do much. Uh, I I also was interviewing with Hilary and Jabez. So I think Hilary, I think you also that Hilary made it. So congratulations. So yeah, basically, yeah. So uh, would uh, the interview was at Trisbus. I I also got an offer for an opportunity for uh, an internship there. 
So yeah, uh, we are actually talking about it. So yes, uh, that's basically what happened last week. Uh, so on the job search phase, on the job search and applying, so I applied uh, like more than 30 jobs while I have time and resources. So yeah, so but I didn't log them on on uh, 10x or leap, I guess. So I'll be looking at the video that Abdul Hamid, I guess, shared. So yeah, I'll be logging that because I was manually keeping track of them. So I will be, it would, it would be easier adding them. Yeah, so I will actually, I didn't actually, okay, this weekend. Okay, I think, I think I'm ready to be applying and heal. I sort out uh, the internship team. So I think I will reach out to the career team for advice and anything that I can give, get, get insight that they can give me. So yeah, basically that's what I'm planning to do. Also work on the challenges because I, I, I didn't uh, submit some of them. I think one of them, so yeah. Thank you. Okay, okay, great. And so congrats to you also on being offered, you know, intern internship at business. Um honestly internship is really good, uh, especially from like um an actual company that's like uh that's like working towards, you know, uh Gen AI development. I mean it's really, really good. It's going to be really great on your C V. Congrats to them also. And yeah. Uh, and also, what's your ideal uh, job application target? I think you mentioned that you've applied to 30 jobs so far. And yeah, uh, Abdul Hamid shared us a video on how to like record it on uh, the next platform. Uh, yeah, so just if you could maybe guess on like maybe what do you think your ideal uh, target per day uh, is? Or what's, what are you thinking? So, uh, so I was muted. So, from from what I actually saw, uh, I think having applying to ten jobs seems a little bit easier if you actually block your time uh, throughout the day. So, like dividing the time throughout the day might help. But having applying to ten jobs uh, per day might, uh, like consecutively, might not work out. So. I think more than 10 jobs, like around 15 would be my target, I guess. So yeah, depending on the availability or the jobs that I can resonate with or that I can feel, that I'm confident I can feel with, yeah. Okay, okay, that's good. That's a good target. I mean, we'll see how it goes. And please, please make sure to like refer to the jobs you've already applied for. And yeah, that's really great. So next we have Abdul Rahman. And we want to see more. I think you have your hands up, Abu Bakr. Is it a, is it yeah. by mistake? Okay. okay. Yeah. Was a question. So is it like, I, I wanted to, if uh, like, uh, if the, opportunity came through the internship opportunity so uh, is it ethical or uh, i i actually let them know through my email there might be a job search so is it for ethical for me to look for job while internship or should i just focus on internship? so after everyone goes we can answer this question if anyone could i had a um, Um, yeah, good question. I mean, uh, you're not necessarily like uh, obligated to apply if you, you know if you uh, if you have accepted the offer. I would say, uh, but maybe we can see how it goes, and yeah, we can have a chat. Maybe, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, great. 
Um, Abdurrahman, you can go next. And also, please, please, guys, we need more volunteers. We've already passed through like 12 weeks, and I expect you to be like fully comfortable uh, to like having this conversation. Uh, yeah, and it's really important. So, yeah, next is Abdurrahman, and please, please, uh, we need more hands. Hello, good morning, everyone. I hope you can hear me clearly because my internet today is not uh, good enough. No, it's, it's great, actually. We can hear you. Good morning. Uh, good morning. Uh, I'm really excited and happy uh, seeing the offer got uh, for Abu Bakr and Hillary. Uh, this is uh, give me a push to, to do more this week. Uh, my target for job application uh, is 10. Uh, I think uh, 10 is a good number for me. Uh, if I can go higher than that, uh, I will do. But also I want to upgrade my skills in machine learning. And uh, this is took also time. And uh, how I, I should balance between uh, all this, the, uh, the sessions and uh, upgrading my skills and also job search, it's uh, it's really hard. Uh, for the third question, uh, I think my application materials are ready. Uh, also, uh, the tutorials uh, are very good. Uh, the technical for the last week was excellent, but uh, it's also hard to, to catch it all on in one week with all this but uh, I'm doing my best. I think that is all. Okay, that's great. And also, did you um, did you have did you have the chance to submit the the company study challenge last week? Yeah, I, I submitted the company study last week. Okay, great. That's really good. That's good. so. Um, ten ten jobs per day is really good, but maybe you can aim for more, since the um uh, the success rate that the help is is like maybe I think one zero point five percent or one percent if I'm not wrong. So it means maybe for like four hundred or five hundred applications you have you would probably get uh, maybe five callbacks for like further uh, further um, assessments and maybe end up having one or two interviews. So maybe putting, you know, maybe having more uh, applications out there is, uh, is definitely uh, useful. It's a, it's a plus. So 10 is the minimum uh, number, but maybe you could aim to apply for more. And yeah, this applies for uh, all of you as well. So yeah, that's good. That's um, really great. So next we have Hillary. Hillary, you can speak up. And also congrats on the offer, uh, Hillary, again. Um, yeah, it's, it's a well-deserved offer, I would say, yeah. So yeah, you can speak up, Hillary. Thank you. Thank you so much. Um, Sorry. Thanks so much. I uh, good morning, everyone. Uh, so last week on Friday, I had the session, debrief session. It was, um, you know, I was being given feedback on my interview and my project as well, the, the one that we did. And um, on that, I was also given, during that session, I was given the offer and um, I'm grateful that I received the offer and uh, I accepted it yesterday and uh, yesterday is when we had communication when to start. So I'm really grateful and I spoke with Abu Bakr and uh, we talked about it and I think the opportunities he was also provided were great and job and to also job is, um, uh, I I thought the positions were like two, but um, uh, it was kind of unfortunate to see that uh, they went with one, but uh, I was hoping that uh, maybe could have been, uh, there could have been more opportunities, but I'm hoping the best for everyone, and I'm wishing they, that uh, you will also get a more opportunities soon. 
so i i had a question on um re regarding if what i should do next and i i asked that and i did get a response so about the submissions the 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 challenge the session the schedules um how do we go about that when maybe we have gotten an opportunity and also maybe you could help us address the other the other concepts on or um the other the other the other things that we that happen after interview like when you get an offer what do you do things like that it caught it caught me kind of off guard and uh, i wasn't prepared uh, with that and you know maybe if i had some information but i uh i was given time to think about it so that's when i had to address some other um yeah, uh, some other things I had to consider. So, I, I, I would, I thought that it would be best if we were taken through that, and uh, you know, that that's my suggestion. But um, yeah, I'm grateful. I'm grateful for the opportunity, for the recommendations, and for for even this, uh, you know, this platform, Gen Academy. Uh, I've been with uh, many other. I've seen other many other people from different institutions, even here in Kenya, and they complete the program, and they are just taken to, through the training, and they don't get any job, uh, so they are left alone on that. But I'm grateful that Ten Academy provides us with this other opportunity to actually get a job after the training. So thank you. Yeah. So. I think you can hear me now. So um, after getting a job in terms of STEM Academy, uh, maybe until you get, until you're like um, settled into your new job, you can still take in, like take part into the sessions and do the, like the challenge, the submissions. Um, yeah, but after you've settled into your new job, of course you don't need to um, participate because the whole point of the supported job search phase is to um, get a job or, um, you know, start into like the process, like the process of like uh, applying, the process of uh, like going through applications and knowing how to navigate the jobs uh, to different sites and also tracking and asking for support, you know, that's the whole point. And in terms of uh, your job, maybe if you want to be extra you could ask your employer uh what's what it takes to like to give him that wow factor and also what he expects from you so that you can definitely uh, uh, prove yourself in the first 60 days or 30 days i'm not sure the probation period could be different in different companies so yes definitely you need to try maybe to do extra i would say because it's uh definitely the time for you to um to like um show your skills uh that you're capable of you know the position and also to prove yourself uh, as a whole so i think we also have this on the careers manual i believe um so yeah you can also refer refer it from there and yeah honestly it's just uh trying to do your best. I think that's all. That's all you need to do. Um, yeah. And also, uh, always, always try not to slack on your probation period, uh, definitely. And yeah, that's all I think you need to do. And uh, yeah, I think that's it. And congrats again, Hilary. Uh, yeah, uh, we're really happy for you. And I can't wait to witness more um, more um, offers being taken, I would say. So yeah, that's really great, amazing. Uh, yeah. So I think next we have um, Tamaska. Yeah, Tamaska, you can go next. Hi. Uh, good morning. I hope you all can hear me. So yeah, uh, last week was fine. Uh, I had a technical issue on the weekend so i didn't do much and i didn't submit the interview uh, separate so what i'm working on is today uh, 
yeah and uh, we can do it more or less time and uh, i will hoping to do more research to apply for more jobs and do uh, more on this code in the challenge uh, and the ongoing submissions so yeah i'm hoping to do i'm thinking to do uh, yeah, maximum of 10, 10 jobs per day I, yeah i from what i've seen uh, until now uh, doing the job applications uh takes some of uh, too much time there are lots of uh, uh essays to write uh, research to do uh, it's not the same on on uh, every site so there are some sites uh, took uh, lots of time and require more input from uh, for the application so yeah uh, considering the, the missions we have to do skilling out to and stuff i think in in sounds a good number so that's my uh, goal for a day yeah. so i'm hoping to apply and the three jobs are okay and uh, yeah the materials are helpful yeah, we are i'm getting good jobs grasp of so i'm still and apply more uh in jobs so yeah uh, the materials and match material is Somehow, um, I feel confident about some of it, so I, I actually got uh, confirmation on the GitHub uh, 500, so my GitHub is done. Uh, refining the uh, projects in the uh, SNL. I have updated all the rest of my application materials, and, and uh, I received uh, the feedback, so I just need a confirmation of is good or not. So that's that. And uh, yeah, I'm doing it this week and I'm excited for the week. So thank you. Okay. Okay, great. So <clears throat> yeah, I mean um <laughs> sorry guys. Uh so I mean applying to ten jobs per day is good, but we're we want to give you like more more room to play around i would say that's why we set the minimum job uh, application target to be 10 so that you can maybe add more when you can i would say so always always aim for uh to apply to more jobs and also regarding your application materials um i think i think you mentioned that uh you weren't fully ready i think if i'm not wrong I couldn't hear you clearly. So, which which materials are you like? Are you not sure about? Uh, I, I, I didn't say uh, I'm not ready, but I I got last update, a uh, last feedback from Pascal on my CV in the, the video. So I did that. So I don't think there is any left, but just. A confirmation of it, it, it is enough or it is fine. I just need that. That I feel confident about my mother more or less. Okay. Okay. Good. Yeah. Maybe you can work on uh, your last feedbacks and then yeah, you can still get back to us again. Um. So yeah, it's good. And also, which which part were you saying that there's a lot of essay to write? And I think I heard something like that. Yeah. So when I applied uh, uh, on some sites, uh, like uh, I think there's a uh, I mean, some of you may know crossover. So in crossover, there are lots of uh, yeah, it is. It's not, it's not a lot, but it, there are requirements. So there are uh, cognitive uh, tests and it seems right. And some other uh, sites that I have like from ask the personality say and motivational say, uh, cover letters. So 
yeah, conducting this on to specific job it might take uh, it is it is a job but applying for a job is actually a job so yeah it multiply that by 10 jobs per day so have you to consider another things uh, you have to do yeah it, it might take a lot I'm not sure about the sites. I don't remember them, but there are a couple of sites. But I, I find the jobs from from them. I, I, I when I apply the jobs, they will definitely do the site. So it's not up to me. Like the LinkedIn expects this much or something. So yeah, some some sites. Yeah. Um, yeah, yeah, true, but I mean, honestly, we do have advantage over this. Uh, I mean, it's great to apply to jobs now because you, I mean, you have LLMs to do, you know, you can just prompt LLMs and maybe, yeah, and of course you need to review it as well, but I hope you're using, um, I mean, ChatGBT or Copilot, I don't know, I don't know which um which LNMs, yeah so i think it's it's definitely like minimizes the application time i would say so yeah yes you always need to think on how you can utilize your time on and which uh which sites or like um llms you want to use i think so yes you definitely have advantage over this so i expect you to lower the application time definitely um, yeah, that's great. That's really good. So next we have Grace. Grace, can you speak up? If you're speaking, you're on mute, Grace. Hi. Um, I am going back to the message to see what I'm supposed to be answering. Ah, uh, okay. I think I can. I can also use it. So, oh yeah, it's pinned. It's pinned on. I can also send it again. Here you go. Can you see it? Oh yeah. Okay. How am I feeling? Uh, I am excited about the week coming. I last week I didn't apply to too many jobs. I think I applied to like ten the whole week uh i am planning to try and improve that by the end of the week uh my application materials are mostly ready yeah um yeah i think that's it okay so how are the materials being shared um and also how is your weekend um. um my weekend was okay i spent so much of it doing research for one interview I should be doing on wednesday so i have spent most of the time preparing ah okay which company and also uh like is it uh, like a technical assessment or like interview and also yeah please tell us more uh same same job that i've been applying for the same one that i've been doing interviews for is still the same one continuing i did the first part last week i am doing another part this week on Wednesday. it will be partly partly technical partly business no, oh, you you mean uh, the job you're applying for, or do you mean the challenges that are being like provided by Ten Academy? The job I was applying for, the Google job, the interview the still yeah. continues. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Really sorry, I, I I totally forgot. So, how's it going? How are you feeling? Uh, and also, how are you preparing for it? Do you need any help from us? Um, yeah, just tell us more. Uh, we had a talk with Hillary. He has helped me understand it better, and 
we found some things I should be researching on, which I've been researching on during the weekend. I was supposed to be improving on my week 12 challenge because that was part of the reason why they chose me. And I'm still working on it. I was thinking of contacting Jabez later today for some knowledge on the autogen agents. That's great. That's really good. And also uh, make sure to reach out to the tutors as well. If maybe if you want them to, if you want them to do like a quick scan of your codes, I don't know. I, I'm not a technical person, but if you just want them to do like a quick look at your project and also I can also tell Matt Mail to do that for you. Um, please drop me a message and yeah, that's great. That's really good. So focus on your interview for now and yeah we can worry about the challenge later on so that's great grace i'm really happy for you and i know you'll do good um this is really amazing this is really good um yeah and also thank you hillary and um yeah jabez will, will also definitely help so thank you both for like for being willing to help and yeah this is really good uh so um i think next we have G gilbert and then yamasi yeah, um gilbert if you're speaking you're on mute um is he not on the call Oh, okay. Um, yeah, Masi, you can go next. Uh, can you speak up? Hi, everyone. Um, for me, uh, how am I feeling? Um, not so great, just there. My weekend was great, though I did not do much of what I wanted to do. I'm planning on doing that today, and I'm working on achieving the target of 10 days a day. Hopefully, I'll do that before the end of the day. And as for my application materials, they're all ready, and um, the materials that have been sent, they're really great in helping us um, remember some of the things that I needed for the interview. So, yeah, that's it from my end. Okay, okay, great. So I didn't hear you uh, on like what your uh, application targets is. I missed that part, sorry. I'm planning on achieving the target of um, at least 10 days, uh, 10 applications a day. Okay, okay, that's good. That's really good. So yeah, I mean, that's good. Um, um, honestly, uh, what we used to do before was um, we uh, we had a target of 80 applications per week uh, and we had two full day application days uh, before. So uh, trainees were expected to apply to 40 jobs per day, uh, twice per week, which will roll up to 80 applications uh, per week. So, um, I mean, uh, we thought that this uh, process is kind of tiring and also, um, yeah, I think it's definitely tiring. So we wanted to like to do like 10 applications, 10 minimum applications per day, which will add up to 50 applications. But we still kind of expect you to go above 10 and yeah, have maybe if you could maybe add five more applications per day, which will add up to I think 75 that would be a good a good number. So yeah, just always aim to go just above the minimum requirement set so so that you will have like uh, a good possibility of you know having callbacks. Um, yeah, this is good. This is great. So and also we have an update. Uh, we won't be having the cover letter uh, session today. It's moved for Thursday because we had another um, overlapping session, I think. Uh, so uh, we've moved it for Thursday. Um, yeah. And what else? Yeah, we will be uh, booking your 101 
uh, session with Arun for Wednesday. Please make sure to accept the invitation. Uh, okay. Uh, we also have the GitHub repo uh, challenge document announcement today as well. And yeah, we will be sending you the 101 uh, session with Arun. We will be for it's going to be scheduled for Wednesday and yeah I think that's all we have and yeah this is great you guys are doing good and please make sure to alert other uh, trainees as well when we have like uh, stand-up sessions or like tutorial sessions so that they will be joining and to have that you know active community and yeah so I hope that's all we have. Uh, yeah, any other questions, suggestions, um, comments? Anyone? Okay, okay, that's good. Um, yeah, maybe tomorrow we will try to have, uh, we will try to join early and cover more people as much as possible. So, yeah. Thank you guys and also really sorry for taking uh, your time and uh, please refresh your Notion calendar for the most of the yes yes thank you uh, thank you Abdulhamid please make sure to refresh your Notion calendar whenever you check your uh, the schedule so that you will not miss any updates um, yeah that's all thank you guys and have a good day and thank you for joining please make sure to join tomorrow as well.